I looked it down and I tried to intention of my brand when I go into the house. I was like, okay, if I want to come up with a gym group, what is it that I need to do in the house to come up with personalities? And if I'm not mistaken, because business, business partners trust me last longer than most marriages, mm -hmm. right? Um, so the reason why we're here today is because today is the launch of Active Lifestyle, right? I'm, I'm not going to go into it. Um, our CEO is going to go into it, but before we start, I would like for us. Later. No, we said we're going to go. We said we're going to go. Okay guys, so yesterday being the 6th of June 2023, Kosi Twala, the winner of Big Brother Titans, launched her active lifestyle brand and the likes of Blue Mbobo, South African actress, was present, a whole lot of people, yeah, yeah, we had the likes of Marvin, so many of them, trust me, you want to see this video until the very end, they came out fully to support one of their own, yes. So here we have Blue Mbobo and Yaya. Here we have Kosi, Yaya and Marvin. It will be recalled that Marvin flew into South Africa just for this purpose a couple of days ago. In case you, you missed that, hey, let me show you. Yes, Marvin flew into South Africa to be with Kosi. He was not only with her at the club with Juicy J, Meli, and a couple of ex housemates. So you can see Meli. Yeah, yeah. Marvin also was at the photo shoots for the Active Lifestyle brand. Yes, he was there to support Kosi while she was walking. They have such a beautiful friendship and I love it so much. Guys, did you catch the moment Yaya threw a sob telling them that business relationships work or last even longer? than friendships and marriage marriages rather yes so this was the moment juicy sorry marvin left nigeria to south africa he was fully dressed like a south african i beg enough of this marvin gist and how he arrived south africa we all know this pretty sure yeah so hey let's go back to the gist of the day being the launch of cozy's active lifestyle branch so here we have Juicy J and Meli. Yes. So here we have Juicy Marvin. I don't know who the other guy is. South Africans, just me. And we have Marvin, oh, best in friendship, best in business partnership. Marvin is amazing. We all know he's a fitness, he's a fitness guy, and Cozy is also a fitness girl. So I guess that's why they relate so perfectly well. So here we have Blue Mbobo and Juicy J, Marvin and Yaya. And in case you missed the moment, Yaya, Yaya threw a sob at Kosi and Marvin. Of course, I did for you. Here you can have it. And tell me what you think in the comment section. Do you think this was directed at Kosi and Marvin or she just said it? To me, I think it was a shot at them because, I mean, there was no relationship between what she just said. So let's have it. Because business, business partners trust me last longer than most marriages, mm -hmm. right? Um, so the reason why we're here today is because today is the launch of Active Lifestyle, right? I'm, I'm not going to go into it. Um, our CEO is going to go into it, but before we start, I would like for us guys is it me but it looks like juicy j has lost a lot of weight i hope it has nothing to do with how yvonne embarrassed him on his birthday i really do hope he is doing amazing well because i know he is a great guy and he will definitely meet someone who is deserving and proud of him so here we have yaya marvin and kosi then we have uh, Kosi, different slides of Kosi, different shades of Kosi. We have Marvin Kosi. I don't know the guy in the middle. If you know him, say hello in the comment section. And we have Kosi and a fan who goes by the name Weldy Jenny. And to be very honest, Kosi needs lip balm. Jeez, her lips are so chapped and they aren't a good look at all. 
here we have the worldy jenny and juicy j we have worldy jenny and yaya we have worldy jenny and and uh, marvin hmm. did i forget marvin's name and we have cozy and her crew okay i like this picture this picture is so cool blue cozy i don't know the two ladies between and the guy oh south african celebrities i really do not know them so guys let's focus on cozy how she you know the behind the scenes for the turning stuff so tell me to be very honest do you know when you watch the video the actual video you think she was turning hey bk okay. wabara but active lifestyle okay. five four oh, three two one there you go are we cheating to your movie i move so the worldy jenny also had her moments with millie and i found this pretty cute and funny hello what's going hey, on millie. we outside oh, yeah dark skin boys oh, yeah. yeah and light skin girl you know what I mean? yeah man come together the caramel la 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 yeah, yes, coke <laughs> so guys let me give my honest opinion on this cozy's you know active lifestyle brand launch i think it was pretty boring and dry yes actually the you know the items the clothing are not out in the market yet they will be out on the 13th of june 2023 but let's talk about the event generally in my opinion it was very dry and boring if cozy hosted this in nigeria hey it would have been the bomb it would have been super amazing well i love that she's very comfortable in south africa and is proud of them regardless of their support or, or probably she didn't want people in fact let me believe she didn't want so much people because to be very honest for someone who won the first season of big brother titans this event was a complete ball fist yes i am pretty sure a lot of you will, will not watch this video till this very point because the videos are very boring and dry so that aside guys hmm okay guys so i actually saw this flyer on instagram and i thought it was just to i don't know nigeria is so hard presently and i find it pretty insensitive when these housemates you know have their official fan pages post appeals and they don't even say oh no don't worry oh kosi wants to visit nigeria she's not ready to come until nigerians contribute for her like what is going on these housemates have become so entitled that was how uh, ibubu made a list of items he wanted for his birthday to be very honest i think it's totally unfair on these fans although some of them are not complaining and some of them do it out of competition oh they just want to outdo each other it's pretty annoying and sad i really do not like that these housemates are now living off fans and that is why you have lots of these housemates not doing anything for themselves because no talent they are not even ready to build themselves just taking and taking and taking look at the likes of bisola during their season they're wearing this lucky but then they build something formidable for themselves i can't say the same about the present crop of ex-housemates well it is what it is for me i have retired from donating to anybody because most of them they don't even use them they just use the money for themselves very stingy and they don't even help people oh well with exception to very few i don't i don't even want to mention their names but yeah very few well guys that's all i have to say sha